Major General Stephen Van Rensselaer III was an American politician, soldier, and entrepreneur who played a significant role in the War of 1812. Born on November 1, 1764, in New York City, Van Rensselaer was a member of one of the most prominent Dutch families in New York State. During the War of 1812, Van Rensselaer was appointed Major General and tasked with leading American forces in the Niagara region. He led the American invasion of Canada in October 1812 but was ultimately defeated by the British at the Battle of Queenston Heights. The defeat was a major setback for the Americans and led to Van Rensselaer's resignation from the army. Outside of his military career, Van Rensselaer was a successful entrepreneur and philanthropist. He played a key role in the development of the Erie Canal, which helped transform New York State into a commercial powerhouse. He was also a major supporter of education and served as the founder and first president of the Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute, a prestigious technical university in Troy, New York. In addition to his military and business accomplishments, Van Rensselaer was also active in politics. He served as a member of the New York State Assembly and was a staunch supporter of the Federalist Party. Van Rensselaer died on January 26, 1839, at his home in Albany, New York, at the age of 74. He was buried in the Albany Rural Cemetery, where his grave remains a popular tourist attraction. Despite his defeat at Queenston Heights, Stephen Van Rensselaer III is remembered as a brave and dedicated military leader who played an important role in the early years of the War of 1812. His legacy also lives on through his contributions to education and business in New York State.